Wix review. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we will be doing a quick look at how you can get started with Wix and what are the pros and cons of Wix. I have used Wix for a while to get started with building my own portfolio website. So what is good, the usability of Wix? What are the highlight features or the gold or creme features that you're going to get? So if you want to get started with Wix, check out the link in the description box down below. With that link, you can get a premium plan on Wix for free. So make sure to check that link out. Now let's get into it. Now Wix is a very popular platform to build a e-commerce website or a normal website and the free version of Wix allows you to create a basic website. However, if you do want to accept payments on Wix, then you have to make sure that you upgrade to a premium version which you can do for free with the link in the description box and then you can start accepting payments on your Wix website as well. So it really is built for all types of people. This is the backend dashboard and let's talk about the usability of Wix. Now, the Wix website editor, which I will be showing you guys in a couple of minutes, is definitely a lot to handle. Although it is super easy to use, the features can feel a little overwhelming considering that there are so many. However, after some time, which is usually around two or three days, most users that use Wix, because of its ease of use, are able to use all the features to their maximum potential. Because it's easy to use, it's a drag and drop based editor, and you really can't mess things up if you're working with a template. However, with Wix, because of the ease of customization, there are times when you can mess up your website because you can make a font too large, too small, you can increase the padding too much, you can move images wherever you want. So because of that, sometimes it can be a hassle to fix those things up. Now in terms of the backend dashboard, it's pretty standard. It's easy to use and it provides you with detailed reporting and analytics as well as marketing tools. One of the highlights of Wix is that it is pretty integratable into your marketing tools. You can see if you go into the marketing and SEO section of your Wix website, then you can see that you have Instagram and Facebook ads, email marketing, you can get reporting, analytics, and you can also link your Google business profile as well as your Google site. You can manage your SEO, email marketing, Facebook, Instagram ads as well as create business cards directly on Wix. You can also create discount codes, coupons, and manage your social media marketing with Wix as well. This is not a feature that you're going to find in every other website builder. It's unique to Wix and it allows you to make sure that your website, your social media handles, your Google business listing, all of them look like they're on the same page because it's really not appealing when a website is saying something something else and a google site listing is very outdated or a social media profile hasn't been updated for a while but the you know other social media profiles or website is so out of touch so it's really easy to keep everything all in one place and wix is going to allow you to do that while keeping your website the center of attention and this is especially helpful if you're trying to sell products so if you're using this for e-com it's very good for you now, if you take a look at the analytics and reporting in the Wix dashboard, you guys will see you will get data from uh, all over your website. You will be able to see your sales, marketing, behavior overview, basic reports, insights, benchmarks, site speed, and basic security features as well. One of the most important features on Wix is the behavior overview. The behavior overview is going to allow you to see customer behavior, what kind of crawlability your website is offering, how customers are navigating through your website to better improve the customer experience. Now let's go back into the Wix website builder. And let's take a look at their editor and the features that it has. Now, there are two options with Wix, which is really nice because if you're someone that is not into design and you just want a website to be there, then you can use this feature where it basically allows you to answer a couple of questions and then it will build your website for you. This can be great for someone that is looking for just a online presence and nothing more. And if you are that person, then check the link in the description box down below to avail a one year free domain main name with Wix as well because on the purchase of any plan on Wix you will get a free domain for one year so check that link out if you're someone that really likes to design or if you just want to build your website according to your own taste then you can use a template or 
take a blank template as well. So if you go into blank templates over here, there are quite a few different options where it basically just provides you with a layout and you can fill that layout out however you want. But if you want a pre-existing template, you have multiple different categories and niches that you can pick out from. Let's say I want to build a creative or portfolio type website for maybe my art and illustration. I can just open this up and you guys can see there are so many different types of templates I can pick out from. They're all very unique and very interesting to look at. Plus, all of them have the core features that you would need for that specific niche of industry or, you know, niche of business. So if I want to have, you know, e-com features, I can choose a e-com niche and those store templates will have all of the basic necessities or integrations that I would need in my e-commerce store on Wix, which is a feature that I really like. I don't have to, you know, go through all the plugins and install the plugins manually because when I tried building my website that way with a blank slate, it was just way too complicated figuring out what plugin is going to work the best with, you know, what other integration do I need and having all of those things look cohesive on a website can be a bit overwhelming. Now, let's take this little template over here. Let's take this one and click on edit and let's get into the Wix website editor, which is probably one of my top favorite website editors simply because of the ease of customization and really how you can make your website your own which a lot of templates don't offer you this feature because a lot of the times when you work with a template, it can feel as though at the end of your editing, the template still looks like a template. It really doesn't look like your own website. So you guys can see over here, this is our template and you guys will see it's adding Wix bookings because that is a feature that has been integrated into this template. So if you don't want a feature, you can also remove it and you can put in your own features that you do require for your website or online presence. So I'm just going to wait a couple of seconds for this to be completed. It can take a minute or two to load up your entire templates, depending on how heavy your template is, how many integrations it has, how many live features it has. So depending on the template that you have, it can take a few minutes, but usually it loads within like three to four minutes. So we're just going to wait for this to be loaded up. So our template has been loaded. It took around five minutes for this to be completed and that is a pretty standard time considering how many different integrations and features are embedded in this template. Now, the first thing that is going to pop up is going to be the details about your site. You can use AI to write content for your site now as well, which is something that is very innovative and it's really with the time so your website also looks with the time now i have other website builders i've tried out other website builders as well but comparatively i think wix does a better job with keeping up although there are some other website builders as well that are introducing ai now but wix has also introduced it and you can just enter basic information like let's say our brand name is going to be uh, aqua and the type of business is going to be retail or let's say it's going to be just a portrait photographer and you can add some details about your site so and then i can just click on create site text and it will start generating content according to the information i've provided obviously the more detailed information that you provide the more detailed the content about your site is going to be now you guys will see this is our template over here we're just going to zoom in a little now you guys can see this is our basic template to remove pages that you might not need for your basic needs you can just click on over here on the top left and you will see all of your pages click on manage pages over here and then you can delete any page you don't require on the bottom you have on your bottom left you have your business features which is basically your business suite on wix where you can manage all the integrations present now this template actually has wix stores but i don't want that so i can just click on delete app over here it will uninstall the app and all of the pages that have been added in accordance to that application will also be removed so i don't have to individually remove all those pages all those items i can just remove the app or the integration of the wix stores and that entire thing will be removed from my website to edit anything you can just do a double click on the item and you can just edit it however you want let's say this is going to be uh sarah rodriguez 
and I might want to increase the size a little of this. And now I'm just going to edit my text like this. You can see your collections and I'm just going to save it like so. And just like that, I have edited, you know, the basic text. Obviously, this is linked to a collection. Now, you guys can build multiple different pages of multiple different products or collections. You can click on add section to add your own customizable section. Or if you want to remove any section from your pre-existing pre template, you can easily select the entire section and delete it simply by clicking on the section. You can click on these three dots on the right side and click on delete over here, and it would remove that section. So, Wix in general is a great platform to use if you are someone that is not very code savvy and you're not really someone that's into writing code and you want a simple easy to use website. I would recommend it for all types of uses, especially people that are looking for online presences for just a portfolio or just, you know, a basic online presence for you or your business. The ecom features on Wix are amazing and I do think if you upgrade to a business version which you can avail for free with the link in the description box down below it's definitely going to work a lot more it's going to be a lot more seamless a lot more effective and a lot more useful for you then but I do think that the just basic plan on Wix is not going to be worth the money. So I do think the five extra dollars with the $35 plan are going to help you a lot with just the general usability of Wix. In general, it's going to be a great platform to build your website, especially if you're someone that's building their first or second website. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And I will catch you guys in the next video.